Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome back. All right. I don't know what we're doing. Let's see. Temperance already did fire. Three of Pentacles. Earth is up next. Weekend energy. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Let's see. 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 Capricorn weekend energy. Taurus Virgo Capricorn weekend energy. Some of you are just straight up meditating. You got the world. Some of you are being guided. Something's over. There's a new door opening. Well, you're going within. You're trying to figure it out, right? Yeah, this is an ending. The hermit, the world, the ten of swords. So there's, there's clearly a choice. Because when you're in deep, you know, introspection like that, if you're making a choice like something is just like done that song just came to me dead and gone it's dead and gone nine of wands someone's worried about something clearly i like that card queen of pence one more for Taurus Virgo Capricorn. King of Swords. Three of Pence at the bottom of the deck and the Wheel of Fortune. And the Nine of Pence. So something clearly can go in a better direction. Okay, It's just a matter of... This is a matter of how you're pursuing something. It's, it's how you're looking at some something. Am I ready to be a team player? Am I ready to go in this direction? Am I ready to close chapters? This is staying in a chapter that's painful. It's like, look, the King of Swords is like looking right up at the Ten of Swords. Like this is this is a painful ending. Someone sees something coming now. So whoever's making a decision this weekend to move forward, which is the hermit, which is Taurus Virgo Capricorn, it's you guys. Something's gonna go in your direction here, and it is. It's good. I don't know if it, it it's whatever this whatever this is is freeing you. I just don't think you're quite looking at it like that, but this is very freeing energy. So it's it's positive. I mean, this is like really going within. It looks like you know, masculine, masculine. Masculine, you're being taught something here. There's a lesson here. There's teaching. Like this is having the strength to like really push through this. So I don't know if she's nervous or you're nervous regarding her. There's something over with a feminine or vice versa. You do have seduction here, so be careful with the feminine energy. You have a masculine that I, I don't even think would entertain seduction right now. Not in hermit mode. It's, it's not happening. So I don't know if somebody's trying to pull out all the tricks. It'd be a waste of time. Whatever, the, this is an extremely painful situation. 
And it's just showing me masculine energy. But it could be feminine. You could be in your masculine energy. I did do soul's contracts just yesterday. And a lot of feminine were in masculine energy. So it's, it's whomever you are, you know, regarding this situation. Let's see what this is all about. You might be dealing with somebody who's like pretty quiet, you know, for, for another story, you're dealing with somebody if there's silence, it's just because there's, you know, there's there's been an ending, having a hard time sleeping. Um, get, um, where the fuck did that come from? Looks like the feminine might be having a hard time sleeping. But uh, I really can't even read it any other way. I mean, it's, it's just so strong. It's just a message, guys. It's weekend energy. This is a masculine that's, like, really going within. Like, there's no, like, once once you're here, like, this is a, a pretty important decision. It's, it's a given. This is something that's extremely painful, though, that's been being held on to, and it's, it's time to let it go. I don't know if you're trying real hard to, like, be a team player here, but try not to give too much. It's like the minute you drop the weight when it comes to something, this anxiety, like, your health even improves with the three of pens here. And then, again, you have the wheel at the bottom of the deck. So, to me, this is what's going on with a masculine energy. Hold on, let me pray. Okay. Empowerment, yeah. I could totally see that. Especially right here, look at someone feeling empowered. Like I said, somebody's doing this the right way, going about something the right way. And it's a five, so let's change here. Personal power has to do a lot with your third chakra to your solar plexus. Okay. So it says the blessing of Ganesha is is sensing your personal power, being confronted, reasonable, and reliable. The energy of this card is the feeling of optimism and positive energy. Dreams and long-term girls are coming into reality. If you've been lethargic or unmotivated, take time to tune into your personal power. The yellow is associated with the solar plexus chakra, which is a third chakra considered to be the core of your being, the power of Santa. Here, home, self-esteem, willpower, self-discipline, and personality. Ganesha is showing you that there's an important purpose for you in this lifetime on Earth. You're awakening to your personal power in the memory of yourself as your soul. Your healing will be complete when you see the light of your soul and know that the light is truly for you. Every time you criticize yourself, you're weakening what it is you're trying to resolve, loving and accepting yourself and acknowledging the value of the foundation of the balance of the solar plexa. What plexus. When the solar plexus chakra is in balance, you are confident and empowered with a healthy level of self-esteem. You have the respect for yourself as well as others. Have a strong sense of self and your personal power and use it responsibly. Be confident in your talents as well. Love yourself. Be willing to powerfully express yourself. Choose and direct your desires at the time. If you're asking about a decision, all indications at the time is saying to act now. So, Hopefully, depending on who you are, you do act. I, I do see the health thing too. It's like, I, like I, I just, I feel it. As long as you drop something, it's like instant. But this is self empowerment. Like I said, like there's no going back from this. This is self empowerment. Trying to figure it out. Something going in your direction. So it does look like something this weekend when it comes to Earth and a masculine energy. 
you are claiming your power. And I love how it's all yellow back here too. You know, so that's fantastic. This is self-empowerment. I'm just going to um, clarify that for you, and then I'm going to move on to Patreon. I know some of you are like, oh, well, fire was, you know, 20-something minutes. Well, yeah, well, they had more. This, I mean, this is just so clear, Trooper Loops, okay? So please watch your other Zodiac, especially if you're feminine or you're not dealing with this situation. Because this is, this is taking your power back. Or this is figuring out how to take your power back. Or this is somebody who already has that drive, ambition, knows how to take that power back, but has been through hell and back. And is now, like, really, like, figuring it out. So this is positive. Yeah, see, two of ones. There you go. Can't stop thinking about it. This is somebody who is just feels stuck but is not stuck okay so this is an ending with a, a feminine or you're the feminine ending something with a masculine you're in the masculine energy going through this it's, it's just the opposite it's, it's the empowerment this weekend you have to stay strong you have to stay within your power to get through something that could just be starting or and clearly not starting it's, there's already been an ending but it, it's like this ending just drags. It's like, it's the song that never ends. It goes on and on, my friend. Yeah, see? Because you're dealing with somebody with a death reverse that does not want to accept something. You might want to go watch fire. And it could see, it's, it's like their anxiety. See? Five of swords. It's, it's, it's a battle. Tower. But dropping the drama at the same time. Okay. Well, somebody else is dropping the drama. So this is somebody who is making a massive decision and is, is just, the word that just came out is coping, okay? Um, so someone's trying to cope, but this is, you got to do more than cope. You got to be self-disciplined. Like you have to follow through. You're in a, a, a situation where someone is, it's almost like they're making it impossible for you to follow through, but you have to follow through, follow through. I love it. And this does feel like it's it's extremely empowering. And then the next card at the bottom of the deck is making this decision. You know, teamwork, future, contracts, new soul contracts. I There's something new here. It, it's like you're already with somebody in a different realm, too. Good for you guys. Have a great weekend. Bye.